Okay, so welcome. Um, just uh, this is my first Facebook Live for a good long time. So if somebody can give me a, a thumbs up or a uh, um, type yes into my uh, Facebook feed, that would be super brilliant. I'm recording. I'm looking at it on the computer. I can't actually see it yet, but I'm sure it's going to turn up. Um, so uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm recording this on my iPhone and I'm recording it on the back. Is it the back camera? The one that's got the, uh, the better uh, lens. So it's not a selfie, that's the main thing. So I can't see myself on the, on the phone screen, but I am looking for it popping up on my computer, which hopefully it does in a minute, but there you go. Anyway, all right, so um, I wanted to start doing Facebook Live posts um, to really answer questions that I get asked on a pretty regular basis uh, from people I'm either working with or networking with or training or speaking with and I usually try and bunch them together in a in a video newsletter or vlog post that I tend to send out uh, each week and um, and there's always a ton more that I don't get um, a chance to answer so uh, that's where I thought you know I'm gonna do some Facebook lives so let's see how we go with this so um, yeah just before we uh, just before we uh, get going um, I, ju I just wanted to uh, just to let you know that um, my new program uh, speak like a pro online is now live so if you want to head over to my website mikeblissett.com forward splash forward slash speak you will, uh, you'll see it there. I'll say it one more time, mikeblissett.com forward slash speak. You'll see some information on there. I'm going to put a video on there um, tomorrow as well. So you can find out about that there. Um, so yeah, so just wanted to mention that before I forget. So this video is really looking at one of the questions. I've, I've written some notes here down so I don't forget. One of the main questions, I, I got this from uh, having a coffee with somebody, uh, a fellow speaker. Uh, last week and it's um, how do I find uh, so much content to make videos about because I've been making them for many years now and and weekly certainly over the last two years um, without fail so uh, the question was that he asked me was well, how do I how do I um, how do I find all that content um, and that's a really good question I, I hear it from people who uh, whether you're writing a blog or making uh, vlog posts or, or YouTube lives or Facebook lives, uh, it's a common question. So um, I'm going to jump into uh, three uh, top tips I'm going to share with you uh, this time. And um, they're going to kind of, as I say, they're going to link into, if you want to deep dive and get really serious about uh, making uh, more videos and get a, getting better results from making videos then as I say just just pop on over to my website mikeblizzard.com forward slash speak and you'll find um, you find loads more resources there as well so jumping straight in number one is uh, to subscribe to your favorite YouTube channels and it's just um there are some inspirational folks out there I tell you I follow um, people like let's think the latest one is um, Nathan, I forgot his name, let me go, Nathan, Nathan, because I'm live, you see, I can't remember, let me find him. I've got all these names going through my head now. <laughs> if you listen to this, Nathan, I apologise. <laughs> let me see who I, uh, oh, I'm looking at Facebook, here we are, I'm having a blank. So YouTube, <laughs> I can see some of you listening in there, thank you. Um, yeah, so Nathan Drew, um, he's brilliant. He makes uh, um, videos exploring spirituality and you know, sort of things like minimalism. And uh, he travels to different countries. He's living in Mexico at the moment. So I just think the guy's an inspiration. I, I, I don't make videos like him. I don't have the camera equipment that he does or his storytelling you know, style that he has. But... He's just incredible. And the thing is, he's, I don't know, he's about 23, 22, 23 years old. He's really young and he's got a really um, uh, wise head on his shoulders. It's just brilliant to look at. So these are people that I uh, listen to and then a heap of tech videos as well on, um, you know, reviews for tech products, everything from cameras to Macs to 
smartphones and you know, so people like Brian Tong, um, I put links to this at some point down below this video when I finish. And as I say, I, I naturally follow uh, um, and subscribe to uh, other people's YouTube channels just because they inspire me and and sometimes they spark ideas and think oh yeah I could do my take on that or actually that reminds me of something that I could talk about in one of my videos and so that's why I'm saying I think that uh, subscribing to your favorite YouTube channels if you want to make video and you can place video anywhere I'm well, on Facebook live right now but if you want to um, make video anywhere let me go back to this if you want to make video um, on any platform for like Facebook or, or LinkedIn or you know Instagram I think as a as a video vlogger you have to be walking your talk you have to be interested in that medium yourself so um, yeah subscribe to people that you and follow people that you you like that inspire you that you resonate with that you're interested in and they will spark ideas and um, good stuff with you as well. So that's the first one is to subscribe to your favorite YouTube channels. The second um, quick tip, top tip I'm going to share with you is Google search. Of course, I used to joke, um, maybe I still joke sometimes now, but this one thing I used to, well, I used to think it was funny anyway, was a funny line I used to share when I was uh, training. Uh, sometimes is that uh, you know most people think that the uh, you know the greatest invention of all time is the wheel obviously it's not for me it's uh, it's actually Google um, now yeah I know that's that's pretty stupid but as I say my jokes are pretty stupid but the the idea behind that is that of course you can find out so much information by just doing Google searches so if you've got your subject or your uh, thing you want to uh, get some inspiration on whether it's public speaking or whether it's growing a coaching practice or um, uh, um, building your consulting business or you know signing more clients put that those, that search term into Google or whichever search engine you've got but for most people it's Google and you'll get like a millions and millions of hits come back and from that some of them will be wild and wonderful and you'll probably smile and just keep scrolling but some of them some of those results they'll spike your imagination and I'd encourage you to write those ideas down whatever you got because it begins something that a train of thought that might actually ultimately uh, evolve into a, a blog post or some such post for you so I think that's a really um, that's a good thing I certainly use that I even by the way that everything I'm sharing with you today these three steps are the searching on um, uh, subscribing to you, uh, your favorite YouTubers uh, I do that and also people on Instagram and Facebook as well I, I do that so uh, I'm walking my talk and I you know respect I you know I, I get so much um, insight and knowledge and, and ideas from people that they're brilliant so I do that and also Google search I did that early on today massive it's great so I, I walk in these steps as well I'm not just telling you to do it I do this as well and the final step is um, is to join some groups. Again, whatever your whatever your thing is, your your niche, whether it's um, uh, coaching um, or training, if you're a business owner, consultant, therapist, counselor, um, teacher, mentor. If I missed some people out, I said some people twice. You know, whatever it is that you're interested in, playing guitar, um, hypnotherapy. You know, just. There is a group for everything on the internet and whether your place, your thing, your, you know, where you hang out is uh, on LinkedIn or Facebook or Instagram, there's a group for that. So uh, join some of them and have not, not, just, uh, not just be an observer and see what you can take because you know, that's not my philosophy. I think it's great to um, be involved, uh, to contribute. So be in conversations, reply, like ask questions of other people not thinking about what you might take from them but how you could be inspired by being around them and that will give you ideas too so um, the, the guy that I uh, asked this question that I was having this coffee with uh, last week two weeks ago that's this question where how do I find so many ideas to make um, videos with blog posts with so often so regularly is um, I also showed him a little 
um, uh, a notebook that I've got. I, I don't know where it is at the moment. Maybe I'll show you at one time. I've shared it in my blog post at some point. I know I've shared that. Um, and I just, I just write down ideas as I get them on uh, one page. Um, and then sometimes I get a whole list of ideas from that one initial idea that I've got, that bit of inspiration or insight. Um, or sometimes you just write down a few words and it, the idea needs to cook for a little while, for maybe a few weeks or a few months. And then at some point I go back to it and I think, oh yeah. And then I add to it. And that's my framework for making a blog post. Um, if it sounds simple, it, it's pretty simple. It's, uh, I try to keep it simple. I don't write scripts because I'd have to read them, I'd have to type them, I'd have to remember them. Um, and just to write down some real genuine thoughts, some authentic um, ideas about where you are at a particular time. I think for me and the kind of videos I watch and the fine kind of people that I sign up for, not just to watch their videos, but sometimes to do their courses as well, are the people that are kind of like me. They're, they're kind of um, in the moment. Um, they're searching, they're asking questions. Uh, they're kind of, they're, they're, they're exploring how they can, um, whilst of course, you know, we are online, still to be true and to be authentic and to be honest. And so these are the people I resonate with. So on your journey with whatever it is you want to look for, um, this is kind of your quest as well. So hopefully those three steps are useful. I'll share them one more time. I keep looking down because I've got my scribbly paper here as well. So number one is to subscribe to your favorite YouTube channels. I'm a YouTuber, but you know, it could be Facebook or you know, whichever platform, Instagram, all the rest of it. Um, number two is Google search, keywords or phrases, um, just to get those you know, 47 million uh, hits you know, uh, in the results and see what, what happens there. And, and you know, just you just need two or three that are interesting and you follow um, those links and, and they spark ideas and that's good. And then the third one is um, join some groups. As I say, whichever platform it is for you, Facebook or LinkedIn, um, you know, um, join some groups and uh, contribute. Don't just be there to, to take, but to contribute. And I think with all of these, so, you know, even watching, you know, I said I, uh, I subscribe to, uh, you, know, uh, you know, video channels on YouTube. Um, and it's not just, yeah, sure, I watch videos, but I also ask questions, I compliment, um, I give feedback, I do the thumbs up when they ask me to. And, you know, I, I try to um, be a, a kind of conscientious viewer. Um, and so it is about being involved and being uh, part of, of their community. And I think that's, uh, if you believe in karma and energy and all the rest of it, as I do, then I think it all kind of fits together and it all kind of is the way it should be. So hopefully that is useful um, for you. And by the way, just before we wrap up, I just wanted to uh, mention if you are serious about um, taking your videos and your video blog, uh, blogging or vlogging um, or promoting your videos or equally um, using video to create content and you know to make courses or uh, training etc um, then if you are serious in that then as I say the doors are, are now open for uh, my new online course Speak Like a Pro Online and, and you can just check it out see what's involved there and see if it's kind of a good fit for you uh, just by going to my website so um, I put the link just below this video or just above it somewhere and it's um it's mikeblissett.com forward slash speak. I'll say that one more time, mikeblissett.com forward slash speak. So um as I said, this is gonna be the first of a, a bunch of um Facebook lives. I'm gonna try and do them every single day. I'm not quite sure what time they will be, so um if you subscribe to my channel you'll get a ping or a notification or something um when it when it goes live. But we're probably gonna um, arrive at a place, a time where it, it suits us all and it suits my schedule and it also maybe sh uh, suits yours as well. But equally, you can get them on the catch up and um, it's good to go. So as I say, I've got, I'm going to be going through a, a bunch of things that people ask me over the next um, few weeks daily. And uh, equally, if you've got questions, you've got comments, if you've got questions, if you want to ask me anything about you know, presentation skills, public speaking, speed to camera, 
uh, building your sub, uh, your mailing list, whatever it is for you, and um, so that this makes uh, number one, it meets your need that maybe you just you know I just enjoy making videos. You know the fact that it's part of my business is kind of icing on the cake. So if you really want to enjoy it and you want to grow it and you want to get better at it, and equally if you want to grow your business and your your subscriber list or um, even sell products, you know um, just I'm here so just ask me questions to leave the uh, questions in the comments box just below um, the video and I'll do my very best in the in the next few days uh, as I get the questions to answer them in a future video with some top tips or some ideas or just my take on it and again this is intended to create a conversation as well so hopefully this has been a useful video as I said I'm not filming it I'm filming it on my iPhone I'm not filming it on the selfie camera though so it's kind of reverse uh, so I'm looking at the back of the phone basically so hopefully I haven't chopped my head off um, I'm gonna find that out when I uh, stop this video but hopefully it's uh you've been able to see me at least you know mouth but hopefully the rest of my, my face as well and um, yeah so hopefully this is useful for you as I say if you want to check out the uh, the new program speak like a pro online that's mikeblissett.com forward slash speak and uh, it's tons of information there and I'll be uh, uploading a video kind of explaining even more about that uh, tomorrow as well. So that's it for this time. Look forward to uh, speaking with you again tomorrow. Until then, take it easy. Take care.